The CO2 removal process begins with the absorption tower, where the process gas comes into contact with the absorbent, a hot potassium carbonate solution. The CO2 is transferred from the gas phase to the liquid phase through a countercurrent flow. The purified gas, containing less than 1,000 ppm CO2, is then sent to the next stage. The regeneration of the absorbent is a two-stage process. The first stage involves flashing the rich solution to a low pressure, which separates most of the CO2. The second stage uses steam stripping to further remove CO2 from the absorbent. The lean solution is then cooled and recycled back to the absorption tower. The process gas from the low temperature shift converter is preheated before entering the reboilers, where steam is generated. The steam is then used to strip the CO2 from the absorbent in the regeneration towers. The semi-lean solution from the regeneration towers is flashed across the level control valves and enters the second regeneration tower, where it is further stripped of CO2. The lean solution is then collected and cooled before being recycled back. The CO2 steam mixture from the regeneration towers is condensed, and the heat is transferred to a demineralized water stream. The condensate is then recycled back to the process. The final cooling of the CO2 stream is performed using cooling water, and the CO2 is then compressed and sent to the urea or other production units. The purified gas, containing less than 1,000 ppm CO2, is then sent to the next stage for chemicals processing.